guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you are well. If you've not clicked the subscribe button, it would mean so much if you could hit that little button before you get cozy and watch this video. So today's video is a highly requested one. Is the Gucci Mon Mon belt still worth it in 2021? Is it still in trend? Should I buy it? I am here to answer those questions and chat to you about it. So get cozy and I hope you will enjoy this video. Any questions you have whatsoever, just leave them below. And there is also a full guide to Gucci belt styling, Gucci belt styles, everything on my blog, mtalks.co.uk, which will also be linked below. So let's go. So first things first, I got my Gucci belt, oh my gosh, years and years and years ago now. And I am happy to say it's still raring and ready to go, happy and amazing. It's one of those products that I think is just timeless, it's a classic, it's one of those forever pieces in your wardrobe, it really is a staple that just goes with everything. The leather is hard wearing, the belt is hard wearing, I get quite a lot of questions asking if the belt's changed, if it's gotten weird, no it hasn't and I haven't really been that good at taking it in its little carry pouch. It's travelled the world with me, it's been bashed around my suitcase and it's fine. I did go for the one that's kind of more brassy rather than super shiny. So I think that's also helped me because it kind of already looks a little bit worn. But honestly, it's been totally fine and the leather has remained perfectly intact as well. And like I say, I'm not someone that has taken the utmost care for it. So I think that in itself is a reason why it's still going to be a big item that people want or that people are wearing in 2021. Because it is a product that and it's one of those pieces in your wardrobe that you can wear time and time again. You know, I was watching Selling Sunset the other day, one of the best programs ever, and one of the girls on there was wearing her Gucci Marmont belt. All you need is things like that, and then all of a sudden there's this big surge and everyone's like, let me get my Gucci Marmont belt out of my wardrobe. Oh my gosh, I want to put it back on. Because it just adds so much to every outfit. That takes me on to my next point, that I think the Gucci Marmont belt is just so easy to style and it goes with pretty much everything. If you've seen any of my other Gucci Marmont videos, I will leave links below, but they're all on my channel. You will probably have seen me styling them in different ways. You know, whether you want to wear it around the waist and pop it with a nice little dress, whether you want to wear the brown belt in summer and pop it with a white shirt and blue jeans, or like me, when I wear my black Gucci Marmont belt, I like to wear it with just an all black outfit. I think it adds such a beautiful piece of designer to kind of black skinny jeans with a black roll neck and that's kind of my favourite way to wear it. I love wearing it with my Burberry trench over the top. My mum has the brown one and absolutely loves it. It goes so beautifully with her blue jeans. This is why you see people switching it up and you'll see someone that originally had the medium sized one but now they have the small sized one because they realise that now they want the understated one to wear around their belt loops. And there are just so many options. As you guys probably know, you can obviously always add in another hole and then you can make it go around the waist. You need to refer to my size guide about sizing because it's going to help you out a lot more. But I think the waist ones look absolutely stunning on like jumpsuits or you could wear it with a gorgeous little dress in spring. Oh, it gets me excited. Basically, the possibilities are endless. They're also unisex as well, so you could literally get one and share it with your partner if you are the same size or just add a few extra buttons to it. I'm actually pretty certain that when I bought mine, they probably sold me a men's one. Men's ones used to be cheaper, but they're not cheaper anymore because they're unisex. So now I think they realise people were buying the men's ones thinking they were cheaper, but they're not. They're all the same price now. It's also a telling point that in any designer outlets such as Vista Village or Woodbury Common or wherever you may be in the world, I personally have never seen the Gucci Marmont belt go on sale. When I go to Vista Village people ask me all the time, oh my gosh, what's a Gucci Marmont belt there? But it's never on sale and I feel like that's a telltale sign that in 2021 you're good, like the Gucci Marmont belt is still going to look great and if you love it, why not? And I think it goes to show that usually in designer outlets they will either put stuff on sale that they made too much of, put stuff on sale that's old season, and it shows that the belts are still churning out as current season because I've never seen a reduction on the traditional ones. And trust me, I know because I'm always doing the research for you guys. I also think they're always going to resell as well, so don't worry if you buy one and then you decide you're not getting much wear out of it. As long as it's in great condition, you can definitely resell it. 
there are some great resale designer sites. I will leave one of my favourite ones down below because I can never pronounce it Vesita, I think, but I could have pronounced it completely wrong. So you can always resell stuff or even Depop. I have Depop and Shellax, cheeky little plug. Um, the resale value of Gucci belts never seems to go down, so it's not like you're going to lose loads of money as long as it's in good condition. And trust me, I don't think they're hard to keep in good condition as someone speaking that's had a few of them in different colours and battered them around over the last few years. Another thing that I think proves that we're not over the Gucci Marmon belt trend is that there are so many new variations and honestly, I always love the original one, but I am a sucker for these new variations. To find out my favourite new variations, head to my blog post below, but I'm going to pop some on screen now. I love the new variations, and I'm probably pronouncing this wrong because shock, she pronounces everything wrong, but the Gucci torsion belt, oh my gosh, my friend Josie has one, and it looks so beautiful, so it's kind of like the Gucci logo, but it's more embellished, and it is just, oh my gosh, it just looks so nice, so if you maybe have thought, okay, I've seen too many traditional Gucci Mormont belts, but I still want one, but I don't want to go with the crowd, get a different variation in a different style. You can even get it with pearls on the front. There are so many different ones now, and I think that's part of the fun, and it shows that actually they're not going out of fashion. Gucci are just adapting with the times, bringing out new colours, bringing out new patterns, bringing out new belts. You could literally collect the whole collection and have it in your beautiful wardrobe room with all of them laid out. Wouldn't that be a dream? If you are completely over the Gucci Marmont belt, there are obviously other designer belts you can get. You know, Louis Vuitton, Balenciaga, Valentino, Prada, YSL. There are so many, and I will link some favourite options below if you're looking for something a little bit different. But I would say the Gucci Marmont belt definitely still has a place in 2021. It's definitely not a trend that's going to die. What I would say is it's weird. I always thought that the medium one was the most popular one, but I have friends who wear like the huge biggest one with like a big jumpsuit to make like a really big statement and it looks incredible like an all white jumpsuit or an all black jumpsuit with like this big double g talk about making a statement fashion darling or going for more kind of like the downsized one wearing it really beautifully just with some jeans very understated like i say i just think there are so many ways that you can wear the gucci mormon belt it's going to sit in your wardrobe it's going to be timeless and you can wear it with so many outfits so many options the colours seem to go with everything as well and it really works through every season. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Like I say, everything I mentioned will be linked below. Any questions, just ask me in the comments guys and make sure you say hi on Instagram at mshalax and if you could subscribe, that would be amazing. Thank you so much guys, bye!